Hey guys, thanks for dropping in for another diecast review here. Uh, got a new Josh Berry car today, uh, 2022 Harrison's USA uh, Xfinity number no. eight. Uh, I've seen a few 164th uh, reviews on this and hadn't seen a 124. So I'm gonna do that and uh, we'll go ahead and get started. Uh, start off with the box, uh, pretty standard 2022. Um, these are like a pre-production or a pre-season production run or something like that. Um, similar to the Dale Jr. Hillman's Martinsville car, um, a bunch of others. I've got an Allgaier, uh, Noah Gregson that are kind of the same way. Just their basic paint scheme, uh, for the season. I think the team's released the paint schemes, um, even before the season started or shortly after and they got going on production so that uh people could pick these up at the souvenir haulers so um this is uh pretty basic um it is uh it is exclusive to josh barry each box is printed uh exclusively for the driver uh but uh as you can see here they did a minimum order quantity of 504 Standard finish, um, pretty basic, uh, just like any other box. So, um, the die cast is uh, a matte finish. Um, starting to get more common uh, for the uh, all, all uh, Xfinity trucks and Cup Series die cast, but um, this one is the first uh, Josh Berry that I've got that's a matte finish. Um, kind of a cool, cool paint scheme. I didn't really think, I didn't know if I liked it or not, uh, before I got the car. Um, and I actually didn't even have this on my list of cars to pick up. Um, but I had saved it on eBay along with a bunch of other die casts that I'm liking, uh, that I would like to pick up, uh, kind of have become a Josh Berry collector over the last year or so and so i had it in my wish list or watch list or whatever and had a seller um offer me a really good deal on this um almost 50 percent off it was like 32 dollars. so i went ahead and picked it up and i'm glad i did um now that i've got it uh it is a pretty cool looking car um the aqua green you see here the camera doesn't do it justice it is a lot brighter in person um, but, uh, yeah, cool looking car. Uh, I got Harrison's USA, Tire Pros, um, contingency sponsors here, uh, white eight on the doors, yellow on the roof, um, going around to the front, uh, normal Camaro nose, just like every other Camaro, um, Harrison's USA on the hood, um, normal engine detail, uh, nothing too crazy there. Uh, Harrison's USA, I guess, is a clothing store, kind of a regional thing to the, I think, I think they are more in the Southeast. I don't know if they're, they're not really a huge chain or anything. Left side, basically the same. Uh, you got the Harrison's USA, uh, rear TV panel, uh, Harrison's USA, number eight, Josh Berry on the back window um harrison's usa and xfinity and barry on the windshield banner so um just like every other arc xfinity or truck uh pretty basic uh, i wish they would do maybe some posable wheels on these um but they have not uh decided to do any more detail on these the tires and wheels on these are kind of GP2. Uh, it'd be nice if they'd do a little more detail. The uh, race one versions have detail, but these standard production runs do not. Uh, this did have, uh, this back window was, had fallen out in the box. Um, this one here on the driver's side. And so I had to take the car apart and, and glue the window back in. Um, to take these apart, it's pretty simple. Uh, they've got a just this plate here you got to be careful because you can break them i've broken them 
I've broken them before, but there's two screws under here, two screws in the middle, and then two screws uh, at the tail, and this, uh, the chassis and body come apart really easy on these Xfinity cars. Um, there's no steering linkage or anything to get caught, um, so they come apart really easy. Uh, just put the window in, um, hold the window in, flip it over on its side, and uh, just give it a dab of glue. Um, the glue that I use, if you ever have that happen, uh, get, I don't know exactly, sorry about my dry, scaly hands. Um, I, don't, I don't know exactly how much this glue was, but this is the Tester's Window Maker glue, and it uh, it dries clear. It's It's made for doing things like this, and you can actually... I don't know. I've never done it, but you can, I guess, fill in an area or something and make window material with it. But I just use it for gluing windows because it glues clear. If you use super glue, it'll be foggy around the, the super glue. So um, that's basically it. But uh, yeah, I, I put that in there. Um, just a dab of glue over in the corner. Let it sit on its side like this for a couple hours and then uh, and then just pop it back together hit the bottom of this plate with a little bit of Dabo super glue and pop it right back on and we are ready to go to the display case with it. So um, that's about it. There's not really much more to look at here, but cool car altogether. Um, like I say, glad I got it. I uh, got a good deal on it and I'm, I'm going to keep it up. I'll, I'll put it in my, uh, put it in my case. I've been kind of a Josh Berry goon for the last, uh, last race season anyway. I've been picking up more of his stuff and, to become a fan so anyway thanks for stopping by